Hello, Christine Chen. Nice Hi. to meet you today. Nice to meet you. Yeah, it's been honoring with you. Oh, that's great. Me too. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let me. We, we have some interview about today, mm -hmm. and we're gonna discuss about why you choose the, to study in China and about your Chinese roots in here. All right. So the reason why I chose to study in China is because I've always wanted to learn Chinese, mm -hmm. and I've always been fascinated with the advancements that China has made. In 20 years, I've never seen an economy grow so fast. And one of the second and the third reason is because my parents, mm -hmm. half, my mom is Chinese, so half of my family speaks only in Chinese. Okay. And I want to come to China to learn the language so I can connect better with my own family mm -hmm. and connect better with my own roots. Okay. And why you choose this product today? So I choose uh, my product, which is Didoc Medical Chat Assistant, because mm -hmm. I think AI has advanced so much so quickly. And a lot of people have always discussed about how it could be used for wrong. But nobody's really focused on what good it can bring to humanity. And I think because AI is so broad, uh, this project aims to limit the scope of AI to something that is usable. Because, for example, ChatGPT, it is for everything and for every everyone, which is good. It's accessible. However, sometimes when we need something that's specific like asking for medical assistance we need an AI that can do exactly that yes specifically yes okay and how you seeing about AI like your medical robots in future mm -hmm. I think in the future, it can be applied to many hospitals, mm -hmm. um, be it Chinese or international. Mm -hmm. I think it will really help a lot of people get uh, access and prevent a lot of diseases because when people get um, help immediately, instead of having to wait for doctors, it can help and prevent any more diseases. And I think it'll be easily implemented because it's just a mobile app and hospitals only need to put in like local hard drives. So I think it, it's very feasible and I can see this project being applied to becoming the average in every hospital. Have you ever seen like the your medical robots is already got a, like the big model like a chat GPT mm -hmm. about in in these days or maybe in future? So yes, I can see the our program uh, mm -hmm. becoming as big as chat GPT. However, if you want to say realistic, I would also see, I can still see it like, being big in China as well, mm -hmm. because I know China and healthcare, there's a lot of people and um, I know it's very hard to cater to all of these people. So I'm pretty sure this program can really help. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so for the interview today. Yes. Thank, Thank you. you.